Gimbledger Garage is a really great game. I'm so happy it's coming out so that I can see what people create in this game. So let's get into how Gimbledger Garage is great. In three, two, one. Let's get the most obvious out of the way. You can make your own games now. That alone is amazing. Like seriously, there's a Mario Sunshine level, a Smash Bros level, a Kirby level, a Sonic level, and so much more. And nobody's bringing up how you can literally change your controls. Like my gosh, yes. I like how Peach doesn't care that I'm about to stab her. Also, I don't think I've ever seen this style of Peach before, and I honestly really like it. Also, I just realized how amazing the music is in this. Like, my gosh, I could literally fall asleep to this music. And I mean that in the best way possible. It's, it's so good. If you want to save the game as a favorite, all you have to do is press X, go to it, go to favorite, and you know what's epic? You can even sort the levels by favorites. That means if there's a certain one you want to play, well, then you can, and that's honestly pretty epic. Even though receiving online isn't as good as the in Super Mario Maker 2 because you need an ID, at least you actually can unlike Super Mario Maker 3DS. I'm gonna be honest, the level in the first tutorial is actually pretty good. Even though you can't jump because you're gonna figure that out at a later date, it's honestly still really good. I think it's underrated how you can literally wall jump in this game. Well, it, in this level, the controls are different, but you can still wall jump, and honestly, that's pretty epic, not going to lie. These lessons might be slow, but my gosh, they're still way better than Wii Music's lessons. Also, I'm gonna be honest, this music's actually really good. Da 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 these, char these characters' colors are red and blue, and honestly, those are my two favorite colors, so that's really cool, not going to lie. When you weigh up to the important things in life, it's hard to get the right balance, and wow! This is genuinely probably one of the most inspirational quotes I've ever heard out of any video game. EVER! Like, seriously, it's so good. Sometimes you start leaning hard in the one direction, and then your world just tilts. ANOTHER GOOD MESSAGE! Like, my gosh! Tilt Nodon has words of wisdom! Like, OMG! Okay, I will count for you. You can count on me. Why, thank you, Nodon! Also, I think it's a really underrated aspect of this game, how the parts actually have their own name. They could have very easily just called it Part, but no, they decided to be bold and call it Nodon. Also, in this game, you make a lot of little things to make one big thing, and that's honestly really epic, not going to lie. I like how Bob and Alice get into a conflict. <laughs> Like, Alice literally spoils something, and guess what happens next? They get into even more of a conflict, and then... Come on, there's no plan. Anyway, Mario Man is the one doing all the actual programming. Shouldn't we see which one they'd prefer? So, technically, I get to choose what happens in this, and honestly, that's amazing! Also, you're gonna make your own 3D platformer. That's pretty epic, not gonna lie. I'm not going to lie. Also, if you wanna know why I stopped at lies, cause, um, at this, at this point I'm recording, my throat starting to hurt a little bit, so yeah. Anyway, moving on. You can go behind the enemy, and if you time it right, uh... Let's try to time it right. If you time it right, you can literally stand on the enemy. That is epic. You also gonna make a lot of levels in this game, and that's really amazing, not gonna lie. Like, you gonna make this, 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 just in the lessons. That's pretty epic. I'll be honest, right now, I personally you don't wanna do the extra checkpoint, but the fact that it's an option for people who do wanna do it is pretty cool, not gonna lie. I love how Alice has her own guides, which will actually help us a lot with this game. That's honestly really cool. 
If you wanted to, you can make infinite copies of a game. I'll show you what I mean. I honestly think it's really cool how you can put your emote in all directions to make the ball move. That's pretty cool in my opinion. So I never used the Notopedia until now, so I'm going to show you what's in it. Alright, go to Notopedia, and you can actually have a lot of information about each note on, and honestly, I'm kind of... I'm kind of sad that I didn't notice this before now, because if I noticed this before the script happened, that would honestly be amazing. Oh look, my logo is fighting aliens! That's pretty epic! Risky run really is risky, let's be honest here. Also, look! Another song that's gonna stuck to your head. Da da do do. It's honestly really good, not gonna lie. This level based on Bowser's Fury is honestly amazing, not gonna lie. Also, I find it really cool how this is the same music as... This level. Also, yes, this level is basically based on Mario Sunshine, which I know Gamer27 is going to love. Also, Wolf of 3D is going to love this Minecraft level. Wait, wait, wait! Mario Kart in-game builder garage is genuinely epic. You can even go back like what I showed in the first few seconds of the footage, and honestly, that's amazing, not going to lie, because Mario Kart is one of the fast-paced games, and this game's honestly really fast-paced, and it's really epic, not going to lie. This is literally one of the most funny minigames ever. Like, point the Joy-Con to grab part. Like, seriously, look what you can do. Like, I can literally just break the thing off. That's genuinely so hilarious, not gonna lie. Like, I can literally break the band off my thing. Also, there's a Pokemon thing where you try to catch as many dittos as possible, and honestly, that's pretty epic. Honestly, though, it's also lots of fun to do this game, not going to lie. Also, why does nobody bring up how even when you press plus, you can literally see the people's work? That's amazing. Game Builder Garage is definitely a game that I want to play over and over again, and honestly, I'm really glad it exists, so thank you so much Nintendo for letting us be able to make our own games now. With that said, make sure to like, subscribe, hit the notification bell, and I'll see you later. Goodbye.